Hey, what's up, y'all? Long time no see and all that good stuff. Well, not really because I did a Hulu video, but I haven't did a video like this sitting down in a while. But um, long time no see. And what I'm going to be giving my two cents on is I was reading this article on the internet. And it was about a 11-year-old black boy in Florida at a go-kart race. And he ended up crashing into this white woman at the go-kart race. And he didn't do it on purpose. The reason why he crashed into her was because some people crashed into the back of him and it slammed him into her. And so she hopped out and she's yelling at him and you crashed into me and you hit me and all this other stuff and whoop the woo, whatever. And she smacks, she smacks the fuck out his ass. The reason why I say she slaps the fuck out his ass is because his eye ended up swelled up. And so she's yelling and to justify it, because the witness is looking at her like, you know, you crazy and you wrong and you know, and to justify it, she's like, that fucking nigga hit me. And so... I guess whoever called the police, I don't know who called the police. I'm trying to figure out where his parents was at because it would have been no way she would have made it to the police without her 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 eyes being busted open, her nose leaking, all that stuff. That could not have been my child. I want to know where his parents were or who was his guardian or how how no, it's it's no way she could have made it to the police without no. And so she tells the police officers, well, I, I didn't hit him, I just tapped him. I tapped him in his face and yeah, I know I shouldn't have hit him, but yeah, I tapped him and no, I did not call him a slur. I did not call him a racial slur, but I'm like this. If you slapped the fuck out of his ass and you were so irate when you hopped out the back of the, I mean, when you hopped out your go-kart, you were so irate and so enraged that you slapped him. You had no self-control, no self-discipline. You slapped somebody else's child. I'm inclined to believe and I'm going to assume and I don't even have to make that assumption. You called that little boy a nigger. And so she got locked up or whatever. And in the process of her being locked up, they find an Altoid tin in her underwear filled with different kinds of pills. So not only that, you hop out your go-kart. And then, you know when you go to the go-kart, especially with children or whatever, somebody's going to tap into you. But he didn't do it on purpose. I mean, they have rules, don't bump people and everything. But sometimes some somebody get out of control or they might lose control. They might not be a good driver and bam. It's just a go-kart. It's not all that serious. And this shit is starting to get wild. I mean, shit been wild. But shit is just getting wilder and wilder and wilder where Karen's coming all, all, all the place. Chad's and Ken's and they've been here, but... Now they're just so bold and we have the internet that it's just crazy and, and like it's it's gonna get I'll be hating to think this, but sometimes I be thinking it's gonna be a race war. And because people are gonna get fed up. I mean it, it's starting to get it been ridiculous, but anytime you have a teenager who's white and they know because they're white. I can take this AR rifle, shotgun, gun, whatever. And because I'm white, nobody's going to say shit to me. He's walking around. He don't even have a license. But if there was a black man walking around with the same AR rifle and had a license, that black man would be dead. So it's just getting wild, and and, and it, I, it, 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 I want to know what y'all would have did. It, it, it would be no way in hell. No, no, no. And I was gonna go in her, in her. I was going to go in, in on her, but mm -mm, that's too much energy. And um, nah, I just wanted to know what y'all wanted to do, and what y'all would do. And um, I wanted to talk about that. What else I want to talk about? Oh yeah, my palette. Y'all can see it's a wire pilot. And it's cute. But the reason why I was excited about this is because I got this from Alta. And a while ago, my sister gave me a $10 Alta gift card. And it was uh, it was years ago. And I haven't used it because I haven't been able to get to an Alta and everything. And so, but I, you know, and I would leave the card at home instead of leaving it in my wallet, whatever. But anyway, and then 
recently I maybe about a month ago I was um on um I got an Ulta account or whatever because I was thinking about yeah because I got so much makeup that I don't really wear but I love I love 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 eyeshadow and I'm about to start playing with eyelashes and eyeshadow again and um yeah and so my sister gave me this card and because Ulta missed me because I hadn't been on Ulta site the Ulta site in a minute they sent me a ten dollar um coupon and was like we missed you. And I'm like, y'all did? And it's like, we're giving you $10 off for anything. And so when I saw this pile, I was I'm going to piles and the wire, the, 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 like the letters, caught my attention. And so that's what made me get it. And it was $39, it was $39, but it was on sale for $19.50. And then with my $10 off coupon, I was like $9. And I had my $10 off gift card. And so all together, I paid seven cents for $40, $20 pilot. And, um, hold up. Let me put this right here because it's, it's a mirror right here. But those are the colors. Those are the colors. And they got Savage. Savage got me because the name and then Chaos is a, uh, I like blue eyeshadows and everything. And, um, yeah, this, <laughs> this pilot, um, here. Yeah. And so this is one of my favorite. This is gonna be one of my favorite piles because it's with seven cents. But anyway, I'm about to wrap this on up. That's all I want to talk about. I don't want this to be too long. Um, I noticed that it had been um, a while since I did a video, and we had some new subscribers, and they let us know that they had subscribed. So hey y'all, hey, I see y'all. Thank y'all for subscribing, and watching, and everything. Um, so I was like, dad, we got some new subscribers. I haven't did a video in I don't know how long. I think that's ooh. Let me go ahead and do a video. So I might start doing weekly videos again. I'm not sure because to be honest, I, I still like doing videos, but it's boring when, when you don't have any interaction or when you, it's like, you know, I know who the people are, you know, because we're well, the people that do interact, we're on different other platforms. So we still interact anyway, but it, it gets a little bit boring. I mean, I don't feel like I'm talking to myself, but it, it gets a little bit boring. And then sometimes you want to have, then, then fools want to come over to my favorite video. Miss Oak Cliff, but I sometimes sometimes it be some the sunset and but anyway, that's why I like doing you know. But, but um, it be some dumb ass motherfuckers on here that just say some dumb shit and try to because people it just be some dumb motherfuckers on here sometimes and sometimes I don't be for that bullshit. Sometimes I can't take that and then I guess I don't be enough drama because it's like. I be wanting to talk to other black females, whatever. Let's let's create this positive, adding value, uplifting each other. And it's like these females like to go to the drama, or it's like they like to go to the other channels where, like reality shit is happening. Because yeah, but it's like they like the drama stuff, and I guess I'm not drama enough. So yeah, I be bored doing these videos sometimes. So yeah, I'm, but I might start doing them again every week. I'm not gonna, you know. But that's all I want to say. And again, y'all let me know. Well, I need some sunglasses on now. Y'all let me know. Uh, what y'all would have did? It's no way. You, 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 you can't fuck with my kids. And I'm not going to jail. Baby girl. So let me stop. But um, y'all always, 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 always stay unapologetic to you. Because I'm going to always... Always, always, always be unapologetic to me. I love being kissed. I love being sun kissed by the sun. But anyway.